Hi everyone, this is Richard. In this video, we are going to go over part and part of. So in the last video, we talked about creating libraries in the lib section and importing it in the main.dart or whatever this um, starting program actually is, but where the main is actually located. What if you wanted to expand the library? Now, if you also remember in last video, we talked about you don't want each library to be too, too long because that defeats the purpose of libraries, right? If you have millions of lines of code in just one or two libraries, it gets very difficult to track and find problems. And if you need to make changes, you have to scroll down line after line after line. But you don't want to have thousands and thousands of libraries if you can help it because then it becomes choppy. And then you have the whole needle in the haystack type of problem. You have thousands of libraries here to actually track down, but now you got to find which is the correct library that you're actually looking for. So you want to get somewhere in between. So sometimes if you have a set library like first library and you're happy with it, you don't want to change it for some reason in and of itself. Maybe you don't, um, maybe you, you're used to it. Maybe you don't want to change the look of it too much just because other people are used to it. I don't really know, but let's just say you want to expand upon it. So this is not no longer good enough. You can use the part and part of. So let's go through this. This is just nonsense stuff. So I just made some integers, some constants for the a library um, and a, a, a function. You say part second library dot dart in quotes part and you mention that the name of the um, uh, library and a semicolon. Okay. Here, the second library, you don't use the term library. Right here, use library. Here you don't. You just say part of. And you notice the, the syntax here. No quotes and no dot dart. You're not referring to the name of the file. You're referring to the name of the library. Okay. You have to have both parts. So part, um, quote, this refers to this is the file that you are adding on top of. So this is the first or primary file. Dead giveaway, it's called first library, okay? But that's just, it's not gonna be called first library for everybody, okay? So this is just an example. So this is first library, part, it has a part right here. The, the secondary libraries, because you're gonna have multiple part, part of, first library, part of this library, it belongs to this library. So this is the one that you're going to have to import. So part, it's the library to which you are adding. And the um, part of is the library you are going to add. Okay. Here we're going to say, create a new function, int craft, int something, return something. Let's go to the main dart. We import it, okay? So we're importing this, but since this is a part of it, we'll import that as well. And we'll just say, print, um, what do we have here? Uh, truck, because that was part of first library, right? And that should work. We have vehicles, that should work as well because that was part of first. Now we also have access to craft um, 55. There's the answer. Even though we did not import second library again because it was part of the first library. Now if you look at this and you say, wait a minute, why didn't you just import, right? So why didn't I just write inside here Um, second, actually, I'll, I'll change that right here, comment that out and say library, library, second, library. Why didn't I just do that? And then I could said import package second library. And then I could have said export package second library. Oop, that didn't work. Ah, I'm having computer troubles here, actually. What's going on?
This is not the Dart editor's fault. I think my computer is actually going a little bit bad. Why can't you just do this, right? So will it, it give us the same thing? It actually will, okay? W what's the difference here? For right now, there's really not much of a difference. Um, uh, th there are differences in the future, and we will go over them. But for right now, it kind of does the same thing. But just remember the concept. This actually is a separate line. These two are actual completely separate libraries. So you have to import this one, export this one, whereas the part part of, you're actually adding onto the library as if you're copying this and pasting it right inside of here. Again, the reason why you don't want to necessarily do that is complexity, making things nice and simple. So if it's not completely clear why you would use one versus the other, probably because it doesn't really make a difference. In the future, I will point that out in which cases it will make a difference, but since we're, we're not even there yet, it won't make any sense. So hang in there, okay? So that's it with um, part and part of, as well as with imports themselves. Thank you.